Hey everybody, welcome to this Windows and Computer channel. And uh, if you are and have updated your machines to the latest version 18.362 of the build, there's a cumulative update that is being pushed to 18.362. So this is, of course, what we know as being the May 2019 update. And this cumulative update, 18.362, brings a host of fixes. So probably they're fixing different little things that are happening with the build right now and of course they're adjusting and fixing things before the May release in a month's time. So it was released a few minutes ago, a cumulative update for Windows 10 version next as they see here which is the next version of Windows 10. So I'll fire up your insider machines. Well you don't have to be in the insiders. If I, um, like I told you, uh, you could opt out of the insider program. This even if you hopped out, is coming to your machine. Don't touch anything. Don't worry. Uh, it's being pushed to fast and slow ring, so everybody's getting it. And if you opted out, like I said, you should. You're getting it too. Uh, this is the next major cumulative update coming up for Windows 10. So um, there's a host of fixes. I'm uh, checking out what's happening with uh, this, but um, you know. They, they are tweaking the version to make sure that uh, everybody is uh, is there and uh, that, of course, they're uh, fixing a few bugs in here, fixed issues with um, AAD users not being able to sign in. They fixed an issue with um, we're unable in a disabled, enabled uh, .NET framework stuff and... Um, they fixed a problem where some people can't actually uh, boot up after they uh, did a Windows update. So uh, be, it says here, uh, fix an issue where a user's PC may get into an unbootable state after installing a cumulative update. So that's coming up to your PCs. Check it out. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. And remember, this is only for those that have updated to the latest version 18.362.